and they're not stupid like they say that about the consumers. But one company was. They're not owned by the same owners anymore. But the company Timberland said, we don't sell our boots to drug dealers. Now, if any of us are in business here, you know the rule of business is 80-20. 20% 20 of your customers are 80% of your business and vice versa. Now, if you're Timberland and you technically make the best boot in the world, then if I'm a mountain climber or a hyper construction worker, how often do I need to buy a new pair of Timberland? They say once every two years. Well, if the community of hip hop adopts you not because of your technical ability, but because of your fashion sense, how often do you think that I was buying a new pair of Timbaland every year? I was buying two new pair of Timbaland a month. Yes, I needed some financial intelligence from one of the professors here too. You know what, baby? And that's why you can't film, because if he catches me imitating him, have you seen how cocked he's looking these days on TV? He will be a definite misunderstanding. He will crack my head over to the white meat. Now, he said to me, you know what, Damon? A no was an absolute maybe. You gotta stalk these people, Damon. When they, you find out that their kids go to school, you go up to the school where their kids are at, when they go pick up their kids, you jump on the car, squeeze your window, put a flyer on the window. No matter what he you do, go to their office because everybody's got to go to the bathroom sooner or later. They can't give that to their secretary to do. Now, Damon, keep calling Jay. I want you to get excited and I want you to. And we go to another video set, put her another rapper, take it back, where's her date? And we weren't washing these things either. So I would put her another rapper, take it back. And after two years, we became known as this huge clothing company. Meanwhile, I was still a waiter.